everybody, this is Artistic Kids, and first of all, you might be noticing that I don't have my webcam. The reason I don't have it is because somehow it broke, so I probably won't be using it this video, but next week I'll definitely be using it. So, you might be wondering, what, so, what M-Block project are we going to do today? But, but, we're not going to even do M-Block today. I decided that maybe we should just take a little break from M-Block for a video and go back to our old friend code.org. So, if in case you forgot how to go into code.org already, you can just search up code.org and then you have this right here. For like right now, I'm going to show you how to make a project so like let's see what what projects are there that we can do so there is a bunch of courses here like uh there's a uh, course d course two course f course a course one so Maybe we can do course F today. So how about we just do functions in Minecraft first? So as um i already know you guys love minecraft videos like actually love them so i'm going to be steve for the video so it says the door is locked but the agent is here to help snap a move forward block to the bottom of the when run block in the workspace to get the agent to the pressure plate then press run and use the arrow keys to move out of the house to collect the chest let's click ok and listen to it so we have to go to move forward so click and now we can get out of our little house and get this chest that we need to get so you really like and as a matter of fact i know you guys really really like um minecraft videos because i see them getting so many views so that's why maybe we should do a little Minecraft video today. So, here's our instructions. Steve is headed on an adventure to help get the map behind the locked door on the right. Snap the code into the workspace to move the agent to the... Excuse me. To move the agent to the pressure plate so that Steve can get through. Okay. So... Now we just we have to move the agent two times and then we can go collect that piece of paper. Let's go. Oh oops. And we made it to the end. So let's continue. Okay. Steve continues on the adventure and needs the compass to prepare for the trip. Code the agent to open the gate. Okay, so we can just do one, two, three, four, move forward. Or we could just do repeat four times, move forward. So we'll just move forward four times and then we can go get our compass. Woohoo, we completed our third puzzle. Now we ha let's go on to our fourth puzzle. So I hope you guys enjoy this video as much as I do. So yeah. The agent can move across water. Use a repeat loop to solve this puzzle and help Steve get to the bucket behind the door. So what we have to do here is repeat seven times 
I saw the roof. Oh, okay. Why is there a turn left in there? Put the roof right there. And we got our bucket. Yay! The fourth project is now complete. So let's get on with the fifth project. You made it across. Now get Steve safely through the maze to collect the axe. Okay, well first of all, the agent has to open the door. So we can just move two times, turn right, and then move another two times. So then we can just go get the X. And we have passed level 5 of Minecraft. So, okay, what is this? Oh no, the bridge is out. Call the agent to rebuild the bridge using the place block so that Steve can get to the shovel. Okay. So, what we have to do is we have to make this thing repeat three times, move forward, and place oak planks. Now we can walk across and then get like the shovel. And we have completed project six. Oh, puzzle six, I meant. I'm sorry. So it says another river but this is this one's much wider fix this code to help the agent build a bridge so that steve can get to the pickaxe okay so we can do one two three four five instead of three times so this should do the trick okay and then move forward and we got our pickaxe so you can also try this out in code.org if you just code go to code.org you can find this in the minecraft section so if you get in got inspired by me which i hope you do and you want to do this yourself then you can go to code.org and actually do this so it says a function named build bridges in your workspace all the code you need to cross the river is what right in snap the small green build bridge function block into your workspace twice to the pat and get steve to the redstone so he said do it twice so let's just do the build bridge twice and we're supposed to get to the redstone pitch. oh right there yay we have completed level 8, or puzzle 8, whatever you want to call it. I call it level, I guess. Okay, level 9. There's ice in the way. The clear path function can help you destroy the ice and get Steve to the minecart. So, we can just do move forward. Oh, oops. We have to do clear path. Move forward, move forward move forward clear path move forward move forward clear path and then move forward and that's enough actually and we have gotten the minecart. So, and we have completed puzzle 9. On to puzzle 10. So it says, can you spot the difference between the two functions in your workspace? You use these functions with other code from the toolbox to create clear a path for the minecart. Then collect the flint and steel. Okay. So, uh we'll have to um first of all make the agent turn left and then we gotta make him move forward uh, 
right there. And then we can fix a short path. And we can turn to our right. Move forward two times. Okay, and then we fix a long path. And yeah, so let's just um, wait for uh, the agent to do whatever he's coded him to do. So now we can use the mine bar to go here to get our flint and steel. Oh, um, two times. Um, so now we can go like that. And yeah. Ten, we have finished puzzle 10. Now, for puzzle 11, it says, Look at the functions below. How can you use them to avoid the gas and help Steve make it safely to the enchanted book? Okay. So first of all, we need to build a short bridge, and then move forward, and then build another short bridge, which should be, oh, we need to destroy the block. Oh, oopsie. You have to build a lot. Oh, that is creepy. Yay, we have finished puzzle 11. So for puzzle 12, it is free play. I'm not gonna do this because you can do whatever you want and you should do whatever you want. If I want to do it, I'll do whatever I want in this one. There's no instructions, just do whatever you want. So I think we should end the video right here. Hope you like my video. Make sure to subscribe, like the, and comment and also don't forget to share. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.